Good morning, loved ones. I hope you had a good night's sleep. I did. I had a really good one. And we had a lovely birthday party for little Gemma yesterday. Uh, it was so much fun. And it's really nice to get to know some of her, you know, uh, preschool friends' parents that you know you just briefly say hi to otherwise but now you got the chance to talk to them and uh, get to know them a little i really appreciate that um i am very 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 grateful for the area where we live it's um it's like an international and and cool area with people who have very often, you know, push themselves a little bit, um, which I appreciate. Um, I love people that regularly get out of their comfort zone. I think it keeps you on your toes and interesting. It's, I, I have the ambition to be like that constantly. Um, I'm also very grateful for my um, best friend. She is the most positive person that I've ever met in my whole life. She has a ability to turn anything that is a negative thing to something that is the best thing that ever happened to you. And um, I love that I've been able to adopt that and, uh, and bring that into my everyday life. I think it's awesome. And I think it's also really true uh, <laughs> that anything that happens to you is something that takes you, you know, to the next stage, whether it's something awful, then you grow a lot. We grow mostly through pain or something amazing you know, that keeps you, you know, so, so grateful for the life you live. Uh, I am also very grateful for for my career, um, I was, talk you know, my sister is a doctor, um, an emergency doctor, and my sister-in-law is, is a doctor, like um, kind of house doctor. I don't really know the term in English. Um, and, uh, and I admire them so, so much for the job they're doing. I think it's magical that some people want to do that. But I also feel so grateful that I'm not one of them because first of all, I'm like frightened of, of blood and stuff. But I also um, wouldn't want to work the way they are working. I think it's uh, exhausting in so many ways. So um, I'm very grateful for them and for their amazing work they do. And, uh, and also I feel grateful that I don't feel jealous or um, less important which I would have if if it wasn't for hours you know spent in recovery and uh, and in therapy understanding you know my worth as a human being for for being the exact version that I am and I'm guessing, you know, I grew up as a, as a younger sister to uh, my sister who's really, really, really sharp. She's extremely intelligent and, um, and a study head. And I was not that. And I guess I developed kind of an anti, you know, anti good girl <laughs> complex. Uh, where I, I I developed you know the rebellion side of myself and um, I can see that too now you know that instead of competing uh, you choose the other you know way and um, I'm thinking of that a lot you know when you're raising children on your own like how to prevent them from you know get negatively um, affected from each other I'm sure it's not possible, you know, they will in, in one way or another, but uh, I feel like awareness around it, like something that I didn't have as, as a youngster and I don't think my parents had it either. I feel like we developed so much, uh, you know, through, through um, the last years with the psychology. So, um, yeah, I just hope that I can do 
the very best for our kids to to become you know the true version of themselves let's do some yoga get down on your sitting bones and straighten your back close your eyes and focus on the area between your eyebrows the third eye lifting Let your third eye help you observe what's going on in your body and in your mind. We're gonna do the breath of fire. We do that by pushing our belly button towards the spine, quick and hard. Inhale, two, three. Very good job, we're gonna do the hip rolling here. We are going to do a shoulders row, inhale up and back, exhale down and up. Let's 
which direction? It's like the dogs are having conversations here. Place your right hand on your left knee and look over your left To the middle, and we're gonna do the same the other way. finish today's class with a short meditation. Close your eyes, focus on the area between your eyebrows, the third eye looking inwards. Let your third eye lead you to the area around your heart. In this area you find an inner room where you're gonna spend some time just for yourself. There is nothing that has been and nothing that will come, it's only you in this very moment. Om Paramatmane Namaha Sri Patanjala Yogadarsharam Atasama de Pada Hatta Yoga Nusha Sanam Yoga Chitta Drashtu Saru Bevashtanam Vrti Saru Vyamita Nastra Vrtaya Panjataya Klishta, Klishta, Slowly come back to the room where you are. We're gonna finish this class together with Sri Shanti. Place your palms together in front of your heart and lean your head closer. Shanti. Shanti, Shanti, place your palms to your forehead with a thick advice through the day, to your mouth for you to speak the truth, and to your heart for you to follow your heart and to be kind to yourself and to others.
Thank you so much for today. Remember to grow. Thank you. I love you guys. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.